I'm a surgical nurse uh, at OR uh, in Beverly Hills, and I know how important looks are uh, in appearances. So um, my hair loss really wasn't that bad. I know a lot of women that suffer um, a good bit with hair loss, but mine was not really that bad. My wife was interested in exosomes after hearing about us injecting it, mainly in, in men, but uh, in, in women as well. And whereas she already had a good amount of hair, she's always unhappy with how long her hair is. I have naturally curly hair, and when it's curly, it looks like it has a ton of volume. Um, but when I straightened it, I had noticed up right in here a little thinning. And so um, my husband, Dr. Michael Hughes, is one of the hair surgeons at Alvear Armani and he recommended some PRP and also exosomes. One of the reasons why hair only grows to a certain length and those people out there that are trying to grow their hair longer and can't, the reason is because your hair grows in cycles. And so let's say it's an eight year cycle. At the end of eight years, that follicle now goes dormant. And so it's only gonna be that long depending on how you were pre-programmed genetically. I had PRP and exosomes done at the same time. Uh, that's an option that you can do, and there's really no downside. There's no side effects. It's really safe. I was expecting it to be super painful, but after the first couple injections, I didn't feel anything at all. They use a 33 gauge needle, which is smaller than a Botox needle, so we all know what that is as women. Um, so it was very, very well tolerable and not bad at all. They took my own blood for the PRP, which most of us women know what that's about. Uh, take our own blood, spin it down, and then use that formula to inject my scalp. We do what's called a ring block. We go around the entire top of the, the scalp with uh, a 33 gauge needle, which is the smallest needle that we could find that we could actually get something through. Then we start doing the injections of the exosomes. Again, it's through a small needle, but uh, there are hundreds of injections because we're putting them per square centimeter so that the follicles around the side of the injection actually receive the local signals to turn back on. After the PRP and exosomes are injected, then they use a micro needler to create like little micro wounds to help the exosomes do their thing. After that, it's done, pretty easy, painless. Living somewhere else, I may not have had this procedure done, but here, like, why not? You know, because it's available and uh, I know how important aesthetics are. So uh, I'm really happy with the results so far.